Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with the brand new 2021 Topps Museum Baseball 6 box half case. Pick your team number one from jazbeescasebreaks.com. All card ship. I think everyone's familiar with the museum. A lot of great stuff here. Breaks one and two will be from the same case. And we can see the case on the top camera here. Let me turn on my main camera. And there we are. Very big thank you to everybody here who got into Pick Your Team number one. Thanks everyone for making this happen. And let's see what we got in here. There's this 2021 museum on here. Let's pop this open. And let's see which six, it's a 12 box case, let's see which six we're gonna do. So we'll select a die. We'll select that one right there. And we'll roll it and we'll go one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. And it's three, so it's one, two, three for the left side. This side, we will do next time. Pick your team two. So we'll put those, you know, it's kind of hard to see the black against the black, but we'll put X's on there so we know they're from the same case. All right. James, how much, what do these boxes go for? We have them on our personal break site for $369.99. everybody to get in early and often because once we sell out of this and next time we get another batch of this the price may very well go up so it's probably probably a good idea to uh, get in early and often yeah it's not a bad price at all especially considering what you can get out of this museum collection. All right, good luck. So there's usually the hit on the very bottom right there. So there should be just one, let's see if we can collect all the base cards here. Okay, that's a hit right there. There we go. Now remember, all cards ship. So we're getting all these cards, the bronze frames. There's a numbered Manny Machado. These cards look really nice. Museum, museum's always a really sharp looking product. All right, our first hit behind Fernando Tatis Jr. is Fernando Tatis Jr., piece of his jersey. Three out of ten. Nice start for the Padres, Brian Peoples. Behind the uh, canvas reproduction card of Ernie Banks. It's dual relic and autograph, Kyle Hendricks.
That'll be for Jonathan and his Cubs. Two, uh, 240 out of 289. Behind Dylan Carlson is a Andres Galarraga. 229 out of 299 for Colorado. Archival autographs. Uh, the Big Cat, as they call them. Aaron with the Rockies. Let's see if this is going to go into a 75. more comfortable in 100. Yeah, there we go. Nice silver ink autograph. And behind the Randy Johnson is a quad relic, Alex Bregman, 17 out of 25. Primary pieces. And that'll be for Yuan and the Astros. All right. Nice little start. Next box. Four mini boxes. Van Leeuwen and Kraft debuting mac and cheese flavored ice cream. Interesting. Good luck. And sometimes those sketch cards right here, they could there could be one of one opportunities there as well. Actual sketch cards, not reproductions. There's Luis Robert to 150. And that'll be for Chicago, Jonathan. Sorry, Jonathan uh, different Chicago, Josh, with that. And behind George Brett is four Braves, Ronald Acuna Jr., Ozzy Alves. Freddie Freeman, Dansby Swanson. Pretty good quartet right there. 69 out of 99. Kayshawn with the Braves. Nice. We got archival autographs. 193 out of 300. Silver ink autograph, Brandon Lau. That's Philip with the Tampa Bay Rays. I know, I feel bad for Acuna too. And they did his ACL, done for the season. Poor Ronald Acuna Jr. It's Joey Bart. Two color, triple relic and autograph. San Francisco Giants, my rivals, Lewis. Or Louie with the with with my rivals, the Giants. Ninety eight out of two forty nine. And behind Cal Ripken reproduction is Jesus Lazardo, three color patch. Thirty one out of thirty five. Oakland A's, Emma with the Athletics. Meaningful material. All right. 
next box. Thankfully, Acuna Jr. is still pretty young, right? How old is he? He's 23 years old. So what, ACL injuries, is that about 12 calendar months? Maybe a little bit earlier for baseball players. A lot of, mostly non-contact, right? So maybe if Braves are lucky, they'll get him back by the beginning of next season. Next box. Looks like our first redemption of the day. Kawhi Leonard, also with an ACL issue. There's Alec Baum. I think Kawhi Leonard got a... And there's, there's Acuna Jr. All right, there's Alec Baum. And now there's the Mount Castle reproduction card and a dual relic and autograph, Keston Hira. For the Brew Crew. That's going to be David and the Brewers. Last spot mojo. Strikes again 70% of the time. They say last spot mojo hits 100% of the time. 168 out of 271. Behind Johnny Bench is Julio Urias. 17 out of 35. He's been having a great season. Two-color patch for the Dodgers. Oliver Soria with the Dodgers. We've got Manny Machado reveals a quad relic. Aaron Nola, 14 out of 99. Primary pieces. And behind his teammate, Andrew McCutcheon, Congratulations, someone is due to receive a framed uh, framed autograph, silver frame, of, so we'll see, team and name, N, New York, it's a New York team, N-E-W, H, the name, it's New York, it's Hideki Matsui, New York Yankees. Silver frame going to Matthew F. and the Bronx Bombers. Nice. Halfway through this half case break. This is pick your team one. Yeah, there's FSU. Yeah, Godzilla indeed. Pick your team two, where are we at with pick your team two? The second half of this case, five teams left. We got Brewers, Mets, A's, Mariners, and Rays. What's up, Jose? So not a lot of teams left, and certainly not the, the most expensive teams are, uh, are actually off the board. So we should be able to do another one, the second half of this, shortly. We'll go through some more orders after this.
Good luck, everybody. Let's see what's on this side. Right, you're right, Rebel. 30 out of 50. Those frames are uh, usually one per case. It's one of the unique things about Museum Collection. They've got a one per case frame. There's Blake Snell to 50 for the Padres. There's Reproduction of Babe, the Babe Ruth. And another a Cub autograph, dual relic and autograph, Nico Horner for Jonathan and the Cubbies. One twenty eight out of two seventy one. We got a archival autograph, silver ink, Spencer Howard. Forty two out of two hundred. Rookie auto for the Phillies, Josh Pruce. Behind Nolan Ryan is a Chris Bryant quad relic, 64 out of 99. Primary pieces. Where does he end up? Trading deadline at the end of the month. It's another one for Jonathan. And behind Jorge Soler is a uh, meaningful material. Clayton Kershaw, 18 out of 50. Dealing with a bit of a, a uh, left forearm injury, but hopefully he'll be back soon. Paul, do you think Cubs are going to pony up and sign them all? Well, I don't know if it's about money for, for Chris Bryant. Unless he's unless he's repaired it to the relationship with the front office. And besides, I mean I suppose they could sign them all, but that would be such a Cubs thing to do, to not address their needs, which is starting pitching. That, that has been the thing that has hurt them the most. They've got young, offensive-minded players coming up the ranks, but if they don't shore up that pitching rotation, I mean, it's not going to make a difference who they have hitting. Smart play would be to, to, to trade Chris Bryant and try to get some assets back for them. And then you could still go ahead and try to sign them again in the offseason, but but there's no reason to extend them extend him now. So I suppose there could be a, a trade and then re-sign with the team, but the smart play for that front office is to try to get try to get some assets back for guys like especially Chris Bryant. Maybe even Rizzo, too. The Cubs fans saw the future in that in that MLB All-Star or in the Futures game. Brendan Davis, that's that's what that's what the future is right there. There's Trey Turner. Yeah, Baez you might keep, Josh, just 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 due to his defense. But yeah, you're not counting on him for offense. 
I mean, I said this. I said this at the beginning of the season. There's more Cubs right here. Wilson Contreras. So I said about the Cubs early this season is that they need to just rebuild and replenish the farm system. 93 out of 199. There's Mike Soroka, Silver Ink autograph. Nice big bold autograph for Mike. I like that. It's going to go to Kayshawn and the Braves. Behind Garrett Cole is Ron Santo, 7 out of 10. Nice. Primary piece legends. Game used pieces of his lumber, Jonathan. That's pretty good. Old Cubs legend Ron Santo. And then behind Miguel Cabrera is a silver ink autograph. Another old school guy here, Cecil Fielder. 44 out of 300. And that'll be for Jeffrey Mason and the Detroit Tigers. Final box. Pick a team one. Pick your team two. Four teams to go. So yeah, we'll go through a bunch of orders after this. This sold out last night, so this kind of warms us up, gets us started for the day. We'll go through about 40 more orders and then we'll see what else we can get lined up. See what else is sold out and we'll add it to the schedule. I know a couple things are sold out already so we'll get those added to the sketch. It's kind of a thicker pack on the bottom here. What's down there? Ladies and gentlemen, yeah, that's all we have. X line, get it before it's gone. All right, Ty Cobb to ninety nine for Detroit. Mookie Betts for the Dodgers to one fifty. Yeah, Jeff likes that Cecil Fielder autograph. And there's Cabrian Hayes. 258 out of 300. Nice silver ink autograph for the youngster going to Chris Maxwell and the Pittsburgh Pirates. Nice. Behind Jeter is a quad relic George Springer Astros edition. 59 out of 99. It'll be for you on in Houston. And we've got JD Davis, 27 out of 35. Game used memorabilia going to the Metropolitans, Eric J. And the book. Let's see what we got. It's momentous material, dual jumbo patch autograph relic book card. All right, 
Good luck. Yeah, they're both Dodgers. Wow. Two color patch and Cody Bellinger's autograph. Two color patch and Corey Seager's autograph. Nice. Oliver Soria with the Dodgers. And that's a one of one. Woo! Oliver. With a little Dodger Joe Mojo all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. What a way to end it. That was 2021 Topps Museum Collection Baseball six box half case. Pick your team number one. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Get into this while supplies last. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye bye.